Hey, my dark and lovely souls. My name is Lynn Graves, and I'm a tarot card reader. I'm an astrologer. I'm a psychic medium. I'm a demonologist. I'm a magician. I do a lot of fun things, but tonight what I would like to do is take this here deck of Rider Wake tarot cards, and we're going to find out what your guardian demon wants you to know. And if you stick with me to the end of this reading, I'll show you a little quick spell where you can find out what that guardian demon might be. So we're going to shuffle these cards really quickly and neatly. We're just going to pull three. We're just going to pull three. Your guardian demon, trust me, he's He's a pretty straightforward guy. He doesn't he doesn't have a lot to say, but what he has to say is a quite important. We're gonna take that, we're gonna take the four of pentacles, we're gonna take the page of cups, and we're gonna take ten threats. A dark and lovely soul, which guardian demon wants you to know is be careful not to hold on to things too much. You have a past love, might be keeping you from a new love. You have a like maybe you got wronged in a career and now you're bitter at an career or field, like, you know, an artist or whatever, and now you're kind of bitter towards it, don't be that way. Do not hold on to the things of the past, because when you let that go, new things will blossom. That's what the Page of Cups is. Cups, I can't talk tonight. That's what the Page of Cups is. It's what your guardian demon wants you to know, because he's sitting there watching you do this, and he's not very happy about it. You're holding on to the past, so you're not manifesting the new, right? And life is temperance, right? Life is a, t life is, well, yeah, it kind of is. Life is a balance, right? You can't have life without death. You can't have love without hate. You can't have laughter without crying. There's so many different ways to parallel the universe, right? We've got to have balance. We have to have our memories of our past, but we also have to look forward to the future. Does that make sense to you, my dark and lovely soul? Say it does. Um, but what your guardian demon wants you to know is do not let the past hinder the future, right? Does that make sense? But also keep the past in mind, but hold on to it. We learn from our past, right? That's what makes us a better person or a better, better whatever. And um, we want to hold on to it, but we do not want the past to cloud our, our, our outlook on the future. Does that make sense? I hope it does. So my dark and lovely soul, your guardian demon who, who loves you, he wants you to know, or she wants you to know, if you have a female, um, don't hold on to the past. Look towards the future. Keep the lessons of the past, but do not let the past define you. Does that make sense? I hope it does. Now, if you want to find out a little bit about your guardian demon, I'm going to tell you a little quick spell you can do, and all you need is a mirror and a candle. What you want to do is you want to light your candle and you want to meditate on it. I would suggest play a song, something that provokes an emotional response. Stare at the candle and just look up. Do that for three days, and on the third day, I guarantee you, you'll see something cool. Comment below and tell me what it was. My dark and lovely souls, your guardian demon wants you to know just let it go, right? And seek the future, but remember the Remember the past, the lessons from it, but don't let the past define you. You are a wonderful person, and you have a lot ahead of you. Let me pull one more card. Oh, and I'm going to pull two more cards, dang it. Okay, so you got the hangman, and then you got the the seven of wands. Again, you don't be hung up on the past, okay? this He's not going to let me tell you anything else. you, you got to let go of the past first so you can move forward to the future, right? That's, that's the lesson tonight. So take that lesson, let it go, look forward, and you're going to be amazed at what happens. You're going to be honestly amazed. My dark and soul, my name is Lenny Graves, and you can find me, oddly enough, here at TikTok at the Lenny Graves, or you can find me over at Dysfunctional Enlightenment, Enlightenment, I can't even say the name of the page, at um, Facebook, and we do a lot of fun things over there, too. My dark and souls, have a great night.